children, settle down now. Now, we all know who's coming into the school today. That's right, the men from the television. So I want you all to be on your best behavior. If you're all patient, you'll get to tell your Bible story. Now, who wants to be first? All right, all right. Mary, you go first. I want you to tell us the story of John the Baptist. Now, here they come. Quiet, everybody else. Quiet now. Come on, you'll all get your chance. Off you go now, Mary. He flew up and he, he called him John the Baptist because he used to go down and um, tell everybody, baptizing all the big people and kids and all, and telling people to do penance and give up their old sins. And so didn't he come to the terrible, wicked woman and he said to her, do penance and give up your old sins. And so she knew penance was hard. And so she said, no, I won't give up me, I won't do penance and I won't give up my old sins. And so we said, well, then you'll end up in hell in the big fire. And then she got raging and she said to herself, I'll get me own back. And so... He got summoned to jail, and this day did the man come to visit him. And St. John the Baptist said to him, Will you do me a favour? And he said, Yeah. And so he said, Will you go to Jesus and ask him, Is he really God or is he a shocking holy saint? And so the man went to Jesus and he said, Poor John the Baptist is in prison. He wants to know, Are you really God? Are you a shocking holy saint? And so he said, tell them what you have to see, and the leopards are cured, the people that are blind can see, and the people that are on crutches can walk. And leopards means that we're all full with sores all over them. And so he came back and the man told him all, John the Baptist all about it. And so John the Baptist said, oh, they're all miracles, that's God. And so then there was the same wicked woman, and um, knew this wicked king and so the wicked king had a party and so so he asked the woman to her uh, and the wicked young one and so didn't he said to her do you want her to come to the party and she said yeah and he asked the wicked young one she said yeah and so they went to the party and so um, he said well will you do a dance for me and so she was only leaning and she said yeah and so she went up and she did a dance. And she and you went up to see it, hey, and she's really coming. And so it was finished and the king said, Oh, that was gorgeous, I'll give you anything you want. And instead of taking earrings or um um a necklace or or a watch or a bracelet or something, or a ring or a gold brooch. And cause rich uh, Kings are all always rich, you have loads of gold. And so instead of doing that, she went over to her mother and she said, What'll I take? And she said, John the Baptist's head on the plea. And wasn't he in jail when he sent out all his soldiers? And so and he came and he cut off his head. All right, children, one at a time. Mind the camera now. Take your time. Don't bang it to it. It was this easy to get them in the morning. Did you get enough there? Well, we can do some more after the break. I love it now that they're on the television. <laughs> <laughs> 